Hello out there. Thank you for joining me today on another edition of All Things Real Estate. Today I am talking about paint. I'm talking about my favorite paint colors for the walls and a new paint color trend for kitchens that you might find surprising. So stay tuned. Okay, I get asked all the time what my favorite colors are for paint in a home. Uh, I will tell you, you probably know this if you have listened to any or watched any of my videos in the past, but white and gray are the two colors that are classic. They are easy. Um, they just go with everything. I painted um, all my walls and pretty much all my house in a white paint from Sherwin Williams not too long ago. It's called Antique White and the way that I chose it was I asked my professional painter and I asked my professional stager for their favorite white colors and they both sent me a list of about three different colors from Sherwin Williams. I don't remember what the three were. But the one crossover or the one the one that was the same from both of them was Antique White from Sherwin Williams. So that was the one that I went with and I love it. I did the same color for my walls as my cabinets and I wouldn't change a thing. I love it so much. So Antique White from Sherwin Williams is really good. Um, it doesn't go yellow. It doesn't go blue. You know, it's a, it's a really good true white color. The other color that I love for walls and cabinets is gray. And there are two that I've used for years and years and years from Sherwin Williams again. Um, those two colors are mindful gray, mindful being M-I-N-D-F-U-L, mindful gray. And then the other one that is very, very good as well is called a new gray. And that's A-N-E-W, gray. Those two grays I have found, so Mindful Gray is a little bit darker of a gray, a new gray is a little bit um, lighter, but what's great about both of those colors is they don't turn blue, they don't turn purple, they don't turn green, they are a very true gray, which is what you want when you choose a gray for your walls. I made the mistake myself of, uh, back when I first moved into my house that, uh, that we're in now, that was way back in 2005, we painted the dining room some Sherwin Williams color gray, and I liked it. it the dining room is fine. Um, the, there's a lot of light in there. So over the years, I just thought, okay, well, that's a great gray color. Well, then when I finally talked my husband into letting me uh, paint the walls gray, um, there's been white painted in there since, but when I finally got him to agree to let me paint, I went ahead and just got the same color that I'd put in my dining room, and I painted it in my kitchen. And guess what? It was not gray in my kitchen. It was blue. And it was funny because I kept telling, you know, my kids kept saying, Mom, the, you know, the, the blue kitchen looks great. And I'm like, it's not blue, it's gray. <laughs> so no one was allowed to tell me that it was blue at that time. But it really was. It was. It turned blue in the kitchen. I, You know, there's just different light in different rooms. It'll turn grays different colors. Um, and that is what I love about both Mindful Gray and a new gray is they really do stay a true gray color. Funnily enough, I just read a design article that said that there is a new kitchen trend this year, um, and it is that cabinets are not white or gray anymore. They are blue. Um, so that's funny. I didn't really want a blue kitchen back then. Um, I didn't want blue walls, and now blue is a trend for kitchen cabinets. Now, there have been dark blue cabinets around for a couple years now, but um, they were in this article talking about light blue and periwinkle blue and that kind of thing. So apparently blue is the newest thing in, um, in kitchen cabinet color. So we will see if that trend continues in the future. So I hope you enjoyed this little um, tidbit about paint in your house and, and the best color paints. And if you have any questions about paint color or anything like that, I hope you get in touch. I'm always ready to give opinions on all things real estate and all things about your home. So get in touch and I hope to see you next week on another edition of All Things Real Estate. And if you're liking these videos, please do subscribe. It helps the channel a lot. Thank you. See you next week. Bye-bye. All things real estate. All things